Hello, this is Tara, and thank you for taking a time out for viewing this video. Well, today's inspiration is the Seven of Cups I pulled for today. And what that's about is achieving our dreams, attracting our dreams, attracting positive energy with the law of attraction to receive the abundance which is meant for us. With the Ace of Cups, it speaks about abundance. And also, today's inspiration, I pull the Tarot of the World and embracing what the world has to offer us. The world also represents achieving our dreams and success, going to higher heights, achieving to the best of our ability. And also, I was thinking about that. The Seven of Cups, which is abundance, achieving our dreams with the Seven of Cups, it's our heart's desire. It's the things that we desire. As we look at the springtime coming in and the summer, we behold the beauty of the universe and what it has to offer us. And we embrace what the universe has for us with the seven of, with the ace of cups, that is. And it's about a springing forth and also with the world. We have to tune in to the energy to in order to receive these things of abundance, we have to focus on the energy of our faith, believing that we can achieve those things that we desire to achieve. Not allowing doubt to seep into the crevices of our mind and not allowing those to fill our heads with doubt. We have to stand on what we believe in. We have to stand on our faith to receive the abundance and the pleasure that life has to offer us in this life that we live. Sometimes we have to take and reflect with self-reflection, reflecting on our past, what we've already achieved, and actually celebrating our past and what we achieved, and not allowing a negative thoughts to seep in, or even negative words. In Ephesians, the Bible says, put on the whole armor of God. Sometimes, let me say most of the times, we have to protect ourselves from words that hurt, from those fiery darts that tries to kill our dreams. We have to put on our armor of protection. We have to put on our helmet of protection to protect our minds but also we have to have a shield to protect our hearts as well. There are people that will come into our lives. They can even make us even stronger, even the negative ones. But those will be people that will come into our lives and be a gift to us as we are on our journey, sharing love with one another whether it's your soulmate, your twin flame, your significant other, 
that person that you share your life with. You have those that are ready to walk with you on your journey. And you have those who desire to cause you to trip or fall. With those people, you thank them because those are the ones that are causing you to persevere even harder. They make you stronger. So the inspirational word for today is the Seven of Cups. Even though your dreams may appear to be in the heavens and the skies, your spirit guides knows your desire. They know what you desire. And even with the Ace of Cups, there's an offer that's coming in for you that's going to bring great abundance that may even, you may even be able to share with the world or it could also be distance as well. Embracing distance, even a love from a distance. And Matthew chapter 6, verse 32. Your heavenly Father knoweth that you have need of all things. So try not to worry about the things that you are needing. God will make provisions. Luke chapter 7, verse 50. Your faith have saved you. Go in peace. So, having faith will bring you to higher heights and a new level. And it will make the things that appear to be impossible to achieve. Your faith will take you to the next level. And you will achieve those things. John chapter 14 verse 27 Jesus says peace I leave with you my peace I give unto you being able to receive the peace that is given from God the universe God will give you the peace on your journey for you to achieve the things that you desire to achieve So remember, faith to achieve the dreams in your life, to activate the law of attraction, and to attract those things that are positive in your life. Remember, make your affirmations, your visualizations, and say it with the power of your words, sending off into the universe, even unto the world. Remember to have faith in those things that you like to receive and watch the pleasure and abundance that you will behold. Remember to self-reflect, to take note of the journey that you've already accomplished and achieved. Celebrate the good things that you have done in your life and the accomplishments. Even if you can't get that from someone else, make sure you take the time out to celebrate. These are your inspirational words that I have for you that Spirit has laid on my heart to share with you throughout your time. Thank you for spending this time with me at home with Tara and I hope the rest of this video will bring you inspiration 
peace and calm.